A 98-year-old World War II veteran close to being fined by the city for an unsafe shed in his backyard has his luck turn around after a group of volunteers step in to take care of it. And Nine on Your Side reporter T.J. Parker shows what these volunteers did from Evanston. This is 98 years worth of collection that we're talking about. On a brisk December day, more than a dozen volunteers did their part to serve a man who did just that for them. It made me feel good. Like, I like helping people. I like making people smile and stuff. A group from Youth Build, an organization that gets kids who didn't graduate high school, a diploma, and construction experience, took time to tear down a shed for blind World War II veteran Elijah Tools. This is a perfect opportunity. And then once we came and saw it and met Mr. Elijah and his wonderful wife, um, it was. Uh, it just brought great pride. I never thought I'd see this a day in my life. Tammy Tools is Elijah's wife. She said the city was going to find them if they didn't tear down their shed. She was concerned as to where she would get the money. I sure was, because you know what? I said, oh God, what, where am I going to get the money to do this? Both Tammy and Elijah are on a fixed income. So for two years, Tammy saved up her quarters, got to $800, but was still short to get the money to tear down the shed. That's when someone told her to call 211, and that's when Easter Seals and the United Way came out to help. I, I said, is there a charge? They said, no, man. I said, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> no charge. It was a blessing. Tammy and Elijah couldn't be more grateful. And now she's going to spend her saved up quarters for something else. So now the, the 800 I was saving to get that pulled down, I'm going to get me a brand new stove. In Evanston, I'm TJ Parker. I got you, I got you. Nine on your side.